Hi, I'm Deborah from South Essex Slings, and I'm going to show you the Baby Bjorn Carrier One in the toddler uh, setting. So, on the inside of the carrier, you will have your newborn zip, which shrinks the carrier to fit small babies, and then you have the wider zip in the bottom. So, I've zipped it into the baby toddler position, and then I'll pop it on. So, straps over your head and then bring your waistband on. Where your waistband goes roughly depends on the height of your child. With a smaller baby it will be a bit higher and with a bigger baby it will sit a bit lower. Clip that together and tighten that up. Make sure the carrier is central on your body. And then I've left a little bit of slack in the shoulder straps but you don't want too much in there the back strap you want low around armpit level and you want the straps to sit parallel on your back you don't want that strap tightened so that the straps come in like that and equally you don't want it so loose that they're hanging off your shoulders so you want it tightened just to the right width to keep the straps parallel on your back so, carry us on, then we'll get baby. So, we'll support baby centrally on your front, with their head up on the firm part of your chest, and supporting under their legs and bottom to encourage that deep seated pelvic tilt. Keeping one hand on baby, and then gonna come underneath this panel of fabric and feed that up over baby's back. And these clips, they slide down onto the connectors there. Then you have clips on the side, and these ones clip on the same on the front. So you come over the top of the clip and slide back into it. So that's baby in. I just need to make baby a little bit tighter now. So I'm gonna pull these straps forward just to make sure baby's nice and snug. And then I'll check that they're both the same length so that I know I've got equal tightness on both sides. This neck support, head support, it doesn't need to be up behind baby's head. They can be free to look around. You can fold that down. As long as there's support up to their neck, they're perfectly fine in there. So underneath here, there are some little zips. So at its widest, it's too wide for my doll. So these zips can be set to fit baby's legs however long they are. You want the zip to sit into the knee pit of your baby. So on its loosest, on its narrowest, it's too narrow for baby. My baby's knees are here. So I'm just gonna zip those zips up until I reach the back of baby's knee. And then I know that that is fitting my baby perfectly. And so that will grow nicely with your baby up to a good two and a half, three years. <clears throat> so baby's in, baby's airways are clear and visible, and baby is held nice and snug so that I can be hands-free. So baby's safe and I'm comfortable. I've got the back strap nice and low, keeping the straps from falling off my shoulders. The waistband's parallel with the floor. I'm comfortable, baby's safe and snug. And comfortable as well. To get baby back out again you will press the button on the clips, pull them forwards and off and the ones up here pull them up and off keeping one hand on baby at all times and then you can pop baby down and take your carrier off. 